Welcome back, everybody. I'm joined now with Jennifer King from West Texas Rehab, and we have a huge announcement. Yeah, we do. Jennifer, I'm going to let you tell us what it is. Today, we are going to reveal our stars and pros for our first Dancing with the San Angelo Stars event, debuting April 25th, 2019. The first ever? Yes. Here in San Angelo? Yes. So what's going to happen? Well, we um, started the event as the signature um, fundraiser for Hospice of San Angelo. Um, back in March, West Texas Rehab merged with Hospice of San Angelo, so um, it's time to set HOSA apart um, with its own signature event. So you're already gearing up for the telethon, and now we're gearing up for absolutely. dancing with the San Angelo Stars. Yeah, Stones. absolutely. We have, between San Angelo and Abilene, about 48 fundraisers. We see, um, on average, about 520 patients a day, um, and regardless of their inability to pay. So we do things like fundraisers here and in the community to help meet the needs of those in our community. And with this fundraiser? people can come watch and absolutely. get in all the action themselves. Yeah, absolutely. They can support their favorite stars. They can buy tickets or tables. There's also going to be an opportunity to honor or remember someone they may have lost, and that um, is a benefit for Hospice of San Angelo. And now we get the honors to introduce the pros, yeah. starting with the interim artistic director at Ballet San Angelo, Erin Lane. Yeah. Woo! <laughs> well, next, we have the owner and instructor at the Dance Academy, Stacia McSpadden. He's a retired principal teacher and coach, but he's also a country western dancer, Tim Lehman. She's a salsa instructor and ballet San Angelo teacher, Angel Noriega. Also a salsa and barchata. We're going to hopefully learn when that one is instructor at Ballet San Angelo, Dorothy Noriega. With ASU Cheer, he's a junior biology major, Cade Pence. Also with ASU Cheer, we have a sophomore kinesiology major, Oscar Narvez. We also have two mm -hmm. pros who could not make it today. Angela Brooks, the executive director at SA Broadway mm -hmm. Academy, and Cameron O'Brien. Yes, they couldn't be here today, but they're excited to be a part as well. And you have this stellar lineup. Right. How did you pick them all? You know, we were lucky to have such a great um, community of, of arts in San Angelo. And when we started having these conversations about, you know, how do we get involved, we wanted to make sure that they were local people, um, people who knew the rehab, people who were just willing to maybe just take a chance um, and have a little fun at the same time. And see if they can teach Absolutely. The they're, and they're, they're the best we're in about town. To Absolutely, the best in town. <laughs> and we've matched them with stars that we know that they're going to put on just a really great performance. What do you expect from these groups, these and parents? I think, honestly, what I expect the most is just a really great time. Um, just to support um, a special, um, just a special organization like Hospice of San Angelo for those that are facing end-of-life decisions. Um, and then just, I mean, more than that, just telling the host the story, but having a great time, too. And during the event, is it just the dancing, or is there going to be other stuff that takes part? You know, I think we have some surprises up our sleeve, oh. but really we're just the most excited about featuring our stars and our professionals and the hard work that they're going to put into between now and April. And for people who want to find out more information or already start to buy yeah. tickets, how do they do so? They can contact West Texas Rehab. They can contact the stars that we'll be revealing here momentarily, um, and they'll have that information as well. Because the stars are also going to sell some tables, right? They are encouraging their friends to get involved, um, and through whether it's online voting or supporting through tickets or tables. So the overall winner will be the one with the most votes at the end of the event. So tell me how that works. How do we vote? Well, how do you be, find it there'll out? There'll be uh, many um, opportunities to vote. You'll be able to vote leading up to on our website. Um, if you want to, it's a dollar a vote, and the one with the most votes at the end of the night wins. Oh, wow. So all of the stars that we're about to introduce, they have to pitch for themselves who's going to be the it. best. Yeah, absolutely. And tell me your website so people at home, they always know. Sure, westtexasrehab.org. Everyone, stay tuned, because when we come back, you get to see the stars that will be taking place on Dancing with the San Angelo Stars. I'll be right back.